Hello, beautiful people. I see a little monkey over there. Ms. Riley, I see you. <laughs> what is up, guys? I truly, truly, truly miss my positive people the people who have been so consistent on our videos and I, I i just miss you guys for those who don't know why i'm saying i miss you guys i went on a small little hiatus from youtube vlogs i was getting every now and then random negative comments now don't get me wrong i want you guys to understand i did not go on a little hiatus or want to quit youtube because of people who are negative i just didn't i don't know how to explain it like i didn't want to surround myself um or put myself in a position where that can occur. I'm about surrounding myself and my family with positivity. And I felt like YouTube was opening the doors to... Yes, my baby. I know, I know. It was showing. It was opening the doors. <laughs> okay. Being on YouTube was opening the doors and giving people who have no life the chance to be neg negative on our channel. And I just, I don't have time for that. Like, I don't want to be surrounded by negativity. I want to surround myself with positivity. I want people to look at our channel, watch our vlogs, and get inspired to either do better in their lives or to, you know, if someone who was going through what we were going through, trust in the fact that everything is going to be okay with their babies. And to also show the world that, like, you can have a normal life with a child with disability. Of course, Riley does not have the worst form of disability in this world, but it is challenging for our family, but we get through. And I wanted to share that with you guys. Do you hear her? I don't know if you can see her. <laughs> what are you doing back there? So, I don't want to rant too much, but I wanted to say one, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, to those who maybe felt hurt that I wanted to quit the channel, it wasn't to hurt any of you guys. It was just me, you know, putting my family first and trying to think about what was our best options. And I also want to say thank you. I want to say thank you to everyone who's been so positive, messaging us, reaching out to us and telling us, don't you dare, don't you dare quit your channel. For those who did think I was leaving, don't be mad now. It's going to be okay. <laughs> you guys helped me remind myself that I was not only doing this YouTube channel just to do it. I was doing this YouTube, you shoo shoo, you hear me? The do shoo shoo channel. I was doing this YouTube channel to once again remind people that you can have a normal life with children who have challenges. Um, show people that, you know, not everyone's life is perfect, but you sure as heck can live your best life if you just try. And of course, for Riley, because Riley is going to get to a point in her life where she's going to feel a little bit different. Than other people and she's gonna ask those questions mommy why do i have to wear these on my feet why can't i feel my feet why you know like why do i have this huge scar on my back why do i have a tube in my neck there's gonna be these questions and i want her to always have these videos and have you positive people in her life so she can see that she's never been alone and that we don't look at her like she's different we think that she is as normal as anyone in this world so i had to remind myself that these videos can really help Riley out in her dark times that are to come. I pray that there's none to come, but hey, you guys have been teenagers. Some of you are teenagers that watch this, and being a teenager is hard. You know, she got you guys to always look back on and be like, oh, I have a family since day one. Since day one that I was born, they didn't even know me before I was born, and they've been by my side. So yeah, I'm done talking. I talk too much, guys. I really do. But I figured what better way to come back to YouTube then with showing you guys our organic food haul that I always do. I've been um, posting on Instagram and you guys have been messaging me. Like a lot of you have been messaging me every day. And if I haven't gotten back to you, I'm so sorry, guys. It's just a lot of messages. But you guys have been asking me, oh my God, where do you get your food? Where do you buy that? Where do you, how do you feed um, Riley this stuff? Or what do you feed Riley? I, you know, you guys have a lot of questions. A lot of moms, a lot of dads have questions on what you guys can give your children. So I'm going to go do a food haul for you guys. I may not buy everything, but I'm going to show you everything that I do. And as you can tell from the title already, we are going to 
Target. My favorite, favorite place. And Target is the place to be. So I hope you guys enjoy this. I hope, I hope that this helps some of you people out. Some of you parents. I hope that you guys get some really awesome ideas on what you can feed your awesome little babies. Um, and yeah, I'll see you in Target. All right, guys, so I'm gonna start in the baby aisle. I don't really get much from here, but I do love beech nut fruity oat bars. There's strawberry, banana, banana. Ooh, right, look, they got banana and cocoa. We have never tried this one. You wanna try this one? Yes? Okay. Um, and then she loves vanilla. So this is one thing I do get in the baby aisle. Beech nut oat bars. And I like these because they have quinoa in it. These are two other things that I do get. Riley loves cookies, um, but I do not like to give her cookies, like regular cookies, because obviously that's high in sugar. I do get organic honey biscuits, Gerber. Not a fan of Gerber too much, but I do like these, or Riley likes them. And then multi-grain alphabet snacks. This is sweet potato and cinnamon. Yum. Yeah, that's all yours, baby. All right, let's keep it moving. Uh, but I already have some at home. What I don't have, and this is the first time I've actually seen this one, whole grain melody. That's pretty cool. I'm excited to make this. Are you excited for me to make it? He's screaming. But I do uh, buy this one, organic couscous. I do buy the rainbow quinoa. And I also get, where's the other one? Just the regular quinoa. Oh, here we go. And then this one. And all of these vary in prices. So like the smaller bags are about $4. Um, this one that I just got for the first time is $3.48. So they're not bad in prices. This is another brand that I really, really like. Nature's Path Organic. I get my oatmeals from them. Actually, speaking of oatmeal, I need to get a new one. Riley really likes the blueberry cinnamon with flax. I'm gonna try this apple, uh, spiced apple and flax. We're gonna try a new flavor. Yes, spiced apple. Do you like it? You haven't even tried it yet. Yes, but I do like them. Um, Nature's Path Organic. They have oatmeal. I got, I'm gonna try their cereal. I've never actually had their cereal, so I'm really excited. Um, now they have that news coming out that the cereal has, uh, like regular cereal has weed chemicals in it. Yeah, so they have weed chemicals in it and I'm not about that life. As they said, it's starting to cause cancer and all that fun stuff. So we switched to organic cereal and oatmeal. Your favorite. Yeah, it's your favorite.
favorite side. This is Riley's favorite side. These are dried fruits. They have raspberries, strawberries, edamames, blueberries, peaches, everything, mangoes. Today we're gonna try, I, she hasn't actually tried this one. This one looks so good. Dried mango, pineapple, banana blend, unsweetened. So I have one of those already in the car. Ooh, Gola, they have dried cinnamon apple slices. Wanna try this one? Yeah. Okay. Love this section. Why do I love this section? Or why do I love any Simply Balanced? Because Simply Balanced is not only for children. It's adult food. It's just regular food. So you can eat it too. <laughs> Here is another awesome snack. These are blueberry muffin whole grain cookies. Yes. Look, she just wants to hold everything. Um, they have banana bread and green apple. We're gonna try the blueberry muffin since you love your blueberries. So there's a lot of things here that are missing that they don't have, um, which I wanted to show you, like the organic chicken meatballs, um, they're out of stock of, the grilled chicken, they're out of stock of, and I wanted to show you those. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna grab everything else I need, and then I will show you everything when I get home so you guys can get like a thorough look at everything. Relax. See me rolling, they hate and we are finally home. Miss Riley couldn't hang. She is out for the count. She's been napping. You see her little, her little mermaid. She says, mermaid, mermaid. So let me show you a few things. Some new things that I'm trying. Um, is the blueberry muffin whole grain cookies. This sounds delicious. Delicious, organic, yes. And I'm so excited for this because I am a sweet tooth person. I don't like chocolate chip cookies. I don't like, I don't wanna say I don't like them. I'm just not necessarily like, like I don't crave them. But when it comes to like cake, muffins, I'm in there like swimwear. Like I showed you guys in Target, I absolutely, absolutely love these pre-made uh, or pre-frozen quinoa um, mixes or brown rice mixes so this one is quinoa corn and black beans see damn mm -hmm, mm -hmm. this one also like the quinoa spinach garbanzo beans red peppers and onions don't that sound delicious and miss riley herself loves it too and then you have your quinoa zucchini and sweet potatoes this is her favorite one um there we go and of course, you guys can make this from scratch. You don't necessarily have to buy this. What I like about these bags is that I have a lot of things to do during the day. So if I'm running late or if I have to run to the gym or I have to run to worship practice or whatever I have to do, but I need to feed my family first, these come in good handy because I could just throw them on the stove, cook them real quick, and you're getting the same amount of nutrients that you would do if you made it yourself. Um, but if you don't like frozen content like that, like some people just don't like to eat frozen food, that's fine. You don't have to eat it. You can buy the products or the ingredients to make that stuff. So for example, like I showed you guys, this is the Simply Organic Home Grain Melody. I haven't tried this because I usually just buy the ones that I can just pop into the microwave. Um, but I'm excited to try this one. What I do use or oh, I already bought these. I pre-bought these already. Um, did I use them already? Oh my god! Hold on. I know they're in here somewhere. Here we go. So here is my plain quinoa. You make your quinoa. I don't even. Am I saying that? Why quinoa? Quinoa? Whatever. You get it. You make your quinoa. Um, and then you just cook your sweet potatoes, your zucchini, your corn, or beans, or whatever. And then you just throw the bad boy in here. It's very, very simple. And the directions are on the back if you don't know how to make quinoa um, or couscous. Couscous is my favorite. I do also buy that, but I don't. I didn't buy couscous. Oh well. Oh well. Another thing that I do buy that I did not buy today because I have more than enough at home is my pasta. If you live 
in my house, we love pasta. But of course, pasta is high in carbs. This is my organic whole wheat penne pasta. So good. Um, and of course, when you boil it, you boil it to a nice al dente texture. Um, and if you are a small household like myself, I cook for myself, Brian and Riley. Sometimes Brian's mom, if she's um, home, but if she's not, I don't make this whole bag. Half of this bag feeds all of us, all three of us, which is really good. So you're getting two servings out of this bag for three adults and one baby. Um, so if it's just two of you and one baby, you can probably even pour a little bit less depending on how much you eat. Uh, usually you want to just eat like one spoon of pasta, one spoon of rice, one spoon of couscous get you through the day. So I'm overdoing it, okay? Let me take it to my freezer real quick. Guys, I'm thinking of also doing um, a Trader Joe's one if you really, really like what I'm doing. I don't know if you can see me. I don't think you can. Here we go. Yes. So I am thinking of doing a Trader Joe's organic food haul. Um, let me know if you guys want me to do that because I got some awesome Trader Joe products in here, like this one. Um, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna show you, I'm not gonna show you just yet because if you guys really, really want me to do a Trader Joe's one, I will be more, more than glad to do Trader Joe's. I love Trader Joe's. I did want to show you. I don't have, they didn't have this. Um, I don't know why, but they didn't have any more in the store. I bought these from Target. It's already open. Here we go. Simply balanced. Bam bam. Turkey burgers. I love. Can you tell that I love Simply Balanced? Like I really, really like their food. Their though. I can't even talk. Their food, when you cook it, just tastes so good. It tastes nice and fresh. It doesn't leave you feeling yucky. Really like this. And something like this like this box goes maybe for like six dollars you're gonna buy a six dollar box of burgers in shop right so might as well get them organic um do i have i don't think so i think we ate them all yeah i think we did um my chicken meatballs from target are delicious but unfortunately they didn't have any and i'm really upset because i love love making those chicken meatballs this is something that I got from Trader Joe's. Here's another sneak peek of what I buy from Trader Joe's. So like I said, you guys let me know if you really like this. If you like to see what I buy, let me know. I will do a Trader Joe's haul. Oh, I didn't close it. I didn't close it. Riley loves potato chips. Like, loves them. And I just don't like how much crap is in potato chips. So, I give her organic ones. I know, I know. We just... Why are you turning organic, Crystal? Well, because I want to live a long life for my daughter and I want to be healthy for my daughter. And if I teach her the right ways to eat now, she will be healthy in the future. Right now, as you can see, oh, it is right here, right here. Ain't so healthy, but it's getting there. She eats these bad boys, white cheddar popcorn. This is more for Brian. He loves popcorn, so I buy these for him. They didn't have... Um, Riley loves these. They didn't have any more at Target today, so I do have to make another trip because, as you can tell, we are almost done. But this lasted about a month, so it's pretty good. Miendo. Love this. This is the sea salt. I think they have other flavors. There's no, no synthetic color, no artificial flavor, or preservative. So, like I told you guys, Miss Riley loves her dried fruit. She's devoured. I can't find the one. But this one's almost done. This one is peach slices. There's like nothing left in here. As you can see, there's very little left. This is mango slices. And the one that she really loves are these bad boys. Her strawberry slices. So, I just bought a new bag that she made me open in the car because she's a fatty. She loves these. Blueberry freeze dried fruit. We have never tried these. When I went and bought dried fruit for the first time, they didn't have these. And I opened them in the car. Like I said, Miss Riley was a patty. She was hungry. I had her lunch, but she wanted her snacks. So I bought these. And they taste just like a blueberry. Oh, they're sour. 
red peppers and green beans. What child likes red peppers and green beans? My child. And of course, guys, all of this stuff, you necessarily don't need to buy frozen. You can buy the actual organic product and make it yourself. If you have the time, go for it. If you don't have the time, here's a solution. And if you do have the time and don't want to get the natural stuff, like already that's not pre-cooked, then oh well, no judgment. If people judge you, oh well, tell them to go elsewhere. I like it. We're doing good. We're eating healthy. I lost five pounds. Riley is looking great. Her weight is stable. So it is what it is. And then, you know, sometimes we deserve a little treat. So I got me an organic cheese pizza. I'm excited for this. Like, I'm so excited. I love pizza. And I have not had pizza in a while because I'm on this diet trying to lose 75 pounds, down five, 70 more to go. So this is going to be like my cheat day pizza. So I think I'm going to end the vlog here because I don't want to make this a 30 minute vlog and I feel like that's the way it's leading towards. But if you guys like this video, like I said, I can make this lighting in here sucks. <laughs> like I said, I can make um, more vlogs like this. I can do a Trader Joe's one. I can do a ShopRite one. Um, I like to shop in different places. I don't stick to just one place. I like to go to multiple different places that will fit our eating needs um and then if you guys really want i can also do videos on how i got riley to eat solid foods i can do videos on what riley eats on a daily basis i can do a day in the life of miss riley and mommy i don't know guys you let me know let me know what you want to see let me know what you want me to do and i will try my best to do it for you i am so happy to be back um I did miss you guys a lot and I just like I said before I want to thank you guys for not leaving us sticking by us and reminding us why we started off our channel in the first place I do want to let you guys know to get ready because there are some pretty awesome things happening um, really exciting that we cannot wait to share with you guys I'm not gonna share it just yet because I want to make sure that it actually all falls through the way it's supposed to happen but there's two big things really big things happening and just get ready because our lives are about to change in the most amazing way possible i'm really excited to share that with you guys and bring you on this journey of ours and if you haven't done so already don't forget to subscribe like comment come join the cam fam be one with the cam fam and we will see you next time bye Go to his knees, let God fill the void, get rid of the hate, leave your heart feel joy. They won't break us down.